Hi friends, today we are going to do, we're going to talk about our school family time. And what we're going to do is we're going to make our body get really tight. Now I want you to think about pasta before it's cooked. So if you're a noodle, I want you to stand really tight and really strong. And if you kind of wiggle, you're, you only can do just a tiny little bit. Ready? Are you tense? Are your arms tight? Are your legs tight? Is your tummy tight? Okay. Now, when you're cooking in water, you start to get soft. And so now I want you to relax your shoulders a little bit. Oh, your knees are relaxing so much that you're going to go to the ground. Oh, maybe you're even, oh, I want you to go, go lay down on the ground. Lay all the way down and get super soft and soft and relaxed. Okay, now that you're on the floor, now I want you to... Do some belly breaths. Put your hands on your belly and breathe in through your nose. Hold it there for a minute and breathe out. Listen to my voice. You're just going to listen. Breathe in and breathe out. And one more time. Breathe in. And breathe out. Let your hands go to your sides while you're laying on the floor. If someone lifted up your arm right now, would it be kind of floppy? Like if you get it, it kind of wiggles like wet noodles. That's our goal. Great job, friends. All right, roll over and go ahead and you can sit on the floor or stand back up. What we're gonna do is we're gonna use our faces and I'm gonna tell you something that happens and you're gonna give me a happy face that someone used their calm down techniques or a sad face that they forgot. You ready? Okay. So a girl was playing in the park and someone bumped into her and she pushed them back right away, push. Hmm, think about that. Did she use her calm down techniques? If she did, a smile. And if she did not, give me a frown. Hmm. Did you give a frown? Hmm. She forgot her calm down techniques and then she got angry with her hands. She was angry and she was feeling angry and she needed to put her hands on her tummy and say stop and say, I feel angry, and take some belly breaths before she went over and, and told the person who bumped into her that she was angry. Listen to this next one. There was children playing, and they were, they had materials on the tables in front of them, and uh, someone put down, and a little boy put down what he, the crayon he was using and then someone picked it up and used it, but he wasn't done yet. But he put his hands on his belly and he breathed in and he said, stop. And he said, I feel angry. And then he, and then he did some belly breaths. So are you going to give a smile that he used his calming down strategies or are you going to give a frown? He forgot them. A smile. He definitely used the calming strategies. Oh, I have one more story. There were children that were playing and they both wanted to play with the same thing. And one of the children called the other one mean names. Hmm. Did you hear anything about a calming strategy in that one? Nope. I didn't either. So is it a smile for remembering or a frown for forgetting? It was a frown. Good job, my friends. All right, so now you know, if you're feeling really, 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 really tight, <coughs> pardon me, 
pretend that you're going to become a wet noodle and see if you can relax your body so much that then you melt to the floor and give yourself some belly breaths. Until next time, my friends.